Welcome back to the shop. Today we've got a lot of work going on. I've got a cylinder head I need to knock out real quick. But I thought I'd stop and show you guys a video of the proper way to get stuff on and off of a mill table. Because that's what I have to do next is get that rotary table off. I've got lifting chains, straps, more chains, specialty T-slotted chains, magnets, all kinds of things right here available. A train base, as well as a pouch for the controller. And a lot of the stuff that we use day to day in the machine shop weighs a lot. So don't just rip your back out trying to do what you have to do every day for the next 20 years. That really helps to keep me from having to lift that 100 pound rotary table up and down over and over again. Set it on the table, set it on the rack, set it on the table. Now the next thing that in machine shop operation that we have to do today is to tram this mill. It is three degrees right now and my next operation is going to be done just off center. So, I'm going to clean the table off. Welcome back everybody. We've got a special treat right now. I know everybody likes to see some action and chips being made in their videos. So we've got to get this head resurfaced and I think I've got it pretty much set up. I touched off in the middle of it there. We're down a half under that. It's pretty warped so I don't think it's going to hurt to take a little pass at zero and see where we're at here. Let's go ahead and get started. but I've got to stop this uh, machine but I don't want to hit this.
And that's good. You can see that really only the blown, only really the blown out area here, from what I can tell. Needs touched up. We're coming back with the three thou finish pass here. Let's hope that three thou takes the rest of that up. I think it will. If not, we'll do three more.